Not bad Vega boys for the soul, right? Okay. Now, since we shouldn't have those pricks like right there up our ass. Probably got that vampire again though. He's somewhere around here, but let's ignore him for the moment. Ah, see, now we've got some love for it. You gotta be joking me. I gotta push it over the other way, don't I? This way was a trap, a tease, a throw up. Ah, <sighs> jeez. Oh well, at least they got the portal right here. And at least I actually know what the hell I'm doing for once. Comparatively, everything else we've been doing for the past... How many episodes has it been? You know what, I've lost count. I, I, I don't even keep track of like how long each episode is anymore. Not because I don't want to, mind you, but more because, like, I actually record these in batches. So, I'm not sure if you guys have ever watched the Let's Plays before, and hopefully you have. I mean, then you know who Jesse Cox, Total Biscuit, well, not Total Biscuit, he doesn't do Let's Plays. He does first impression reviews. Highly recommend him if you guys actually want to know whether a game is worth buying that comes out fresh off the stock. Matter of fact, uh... I highly recommend subscribing to his channel. Anyways, moving forward, um, if you watch these guys, they, they all record in batches, and so do I. The idea is, by recording a constant playthrough, we kind of get into a zone and everything just kind of works out. Um, I can almost sorry see where this is going. Okay. Yeah. That's an interesting place for a weapon. And because of this, that means there has to be a... Yep, there has to be a pathway. And the pathway leads to... I don't know. Huh. Does this mean I have to travel through vents now? Hmm. Definitely seems like my overall idea is to. Oh. Hmm. See, a nice thing about the Soul Reaver actually imbuing me with the abilities to sustain myself. Oh, that would have been nice to see earlier. And then those guys are going to pop back to life. Anyways, um, as I was saying, the nice thing about the Soul Reaver imbuing me with the ability to sustain myself 
is I can take longer to figure out these puzzles. Which is definitely a really big help, because... Let, let's face it, I'm not exactly the brightest person out there. I'm not going to claim to be... These things get hard! Like, really hard. Okay, so... Essentially, I need to get up there. Okay, can I move these? Yes, I can. Okay. I'm gonna make an assumption here. I'm going to assume, <clears throat> and follow me on this, that this by itself won't let me all the way up. Also, I'm gonna make the assumption that flipping this on top of this may also not be high enough. Yep, that's what I thought. Okay, I don't think I can grab these. Nope, which means the blocks on the other side here, where this other prick was. Okay, um... This one's a solid piece. So... I think we need at least two of these? Maybe? Oh, I see how it is. So here's here's how this goes. We move this one over, right? And boom, that one's in place for what we're about to do. Next we plug our claws into this one. And then we move it over. And then we're gonna use this one for leverage like we did in the uh the sound temple place. And boom. Awesome possum. Okay, and then we take this one and repeat procedure. There we go. And then we move this over and plop. Okay. So from here. Something feels off. Is there a solid one in here? No, there's not. So... Oh, I see what's gotta be. Did I screw up? Hmm. I'm trying to see if I actually screwed up. I may have screwed up. Hmm. I need to get up there. I probably should have dropped one of these on the other one. Hmm. We're about to find out. Either that or there's another piece somewhere around here that we can move. 
Let's see if I move this to here. This just doubles up this, and I have no way of moving, you know, anymore. Is this a fallible puzzle? Can I move this piece? No. Hmm. Ah, so I can move that piece. Hmm. So you can't jump up high enough yet, but if I had one block higher, I could. However, the only way to get one block higher is to basically push this onto here and then get those over there. Wait, even if I stack them up to begin with? Hmm. Oh, I see what I should have did. Okay. Makes sense now. Let me see if I can reset this puzzle and I'll show you guys. So, now you guys see how I did this wrong. The puzzle should be fairly obvious now. So I'm going to leave the room. Alright, we're going to come back here where it's snowing. And then we're going to run back and hope the puzzle has reset. If the puzzle has reset, which I'm hoping it did, it did not. Balls, 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 balls. Okay, May maybe I'm missing something obvious here. These guys are coming after my ass. Hmm. That obviously moves that block still. Okay, um. Hmm. That part doesn't come loose. Um. Hmm. Huh, I'm missing something. Missing something vitally important. Oh, I see how I can reset it. <laughs> Don't I just feel stupid? See, I, I wasn't thinking about this at first, and I should have. There, there's actually a way to reset this, though it requires a little bit of forethought. So check this. Here's how you reset this in case you guys end up in this predicament. You move this over, right? Well, actually, let me go ahead and move this back and then. Oh. Hmm. Oh, right. I, I need to do it like, uh. This. There we go. Okay, so we do it like that, then we flip this up, and then we move this one.
And ta-da! All finished. And then we just move this over. Simple as can be. I can't believe I didn't see that right away, and I'm pretty sure a couple of you probably did and are going rawr, 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 rawr. If you're not, thank you. If you are, I apologize. If you have no idea what the hell I'm talking about, there are people out there who get so angry when you can't solve a puzzle. I'd be lying if I said there weren't times that I'm like that. It's like, dude, it's right there! Heads up, it's easier to see when you're not the one playing the game. There's it's like a it's like an awkward pressure when you're playing a game. Like it it's always there. If you get what I mean, like if you've ever played a game, maybe not hardcore, but if you've ever played a game and seriously like just sat there for a moment and like then watched your friend play it you sit there and you go, oh my god, I know exactly how to do this. Why why can't they see this? And it, it, it's literally because it's easier to see when you're not, you know, the one playing. I guess I was just supposed to jump down for this. Oh, there's a couple of uh, Duma's little minions too. Okay, I guess I can climb this. Nope. Oh. What's this? Oh, I I think I get it. Either I have to do this. Nope, that's not it. Or I have to light those on fire. Hmm. I don't think that was what I was supposed to do. Nope. Okay. Um. There are these doors here. Oh, these are those one doors that we saw earlier that we couldn't go through. Okay, um. And then if I pull this. That's kind of... Not gonna lie, that was awesome as hell. Like, we just jet propelled our way through this damn door. How awesome is that? And the question is, is how far did this flame go? And can I do it again? And we are... Back here? Hold on. You are just here. Like, we were literally just here. Oh, but Jabbers. 